another fountain pen review. The, this time the Waterman Expert. It, it comes in a set, the fountain pen and a ballpoint pen. We will take a closer look at these. This is the same pen, only in a different combination of the different colors. Okay, we will compare this to the Waterman Man 21 which I always already showed in one of my videos. And here we have the Waterman Charleston. Okay, everything in a very nice set with a, pre with a few envelopes and a cartridge, which luckily is the standard form which you find in most of the fountain pens. This uh, ballpoint pen has a turning mechanism. Okay, we will take a closer look with a different camera angle. Now let's take a closer look at these pens. You can see the waterman. W on the clip and here on the cap ring you can see Waterman and France. Originally Waterman pens were made in in the US. As you may know, Edson Waterman made the first Functioning, functioning fountain pen. I did this in another video where I even show his patent on the pen. This is one version. The other version we will see here with this metal cap and the acrylic body. This is a pen with a relatively small nib and we will see this one uses the standard cartridges. Here we got one version of the pen here. We got the other version and the same with the ballpoint pen. In the writing examples you will also see the Waterman Charleston and the Waterman Man 21. Let's start with this pen. This is a pen which writes, this is a medium nib and not very flex flexible, but it's a very smooth writer. Let's try the other one. Black edition. This 
this one right very now let's try this pen This one has an 18 karat gold nib. This nib writes quite different. It's a more in a calligraphy style. Not very flexible but with a nice line distinction. This is a cap with a turning. And we come to Watermark 21 with this typical clip. This is typical design from the 70s and we compare this nib this is very different from the other as you can see this is a this is an 18 karat nib too but semi-flexible and we have this nice distinction in the line with, with pressure, without pressure. So we can see this is a different type of pen for everyday writing. This pen is perfect. Pen number one and pen number two. Okay, as you can see, a very nice fountain pen in design, very classical. Oh, now I put the wrong. You can actually can use it this way, but these two sets came in this way. Okay. So, esa es una pluma fuente. Yo pienso la más, yo pienso la más barata de Waterman. Si tú quieres una pluma bonita, esa es bien hecho. Escribe bien y con este conjunto este juego con con bolígrafo hace un buen juego also die dieser Wortemann Füllhalter schreibt sehr schön natürlich nicht das ausgeprägte Schriftbild das zum Beispiel hier der alte Wortemann ein und Mann 21 hat aber für den täglichen Gebrauch sehr schön geeignet, dieser Füllhalter und von der Qualität des Produktes gibt 
an der Qualität gibt es nichts zu beanstanden. Ein sehr gut gemachter Füllheit.